I didn't see Back to the Future as a kid, but my friend Joey was a big fan. He told me it had a flying car, time travel, and all sorts of other great stuff, so naturally I was intrigued. One summer day, Joey's mom gave us permission to walk to the video store and rent a game. And when we got there, his eyes lit up at the sight of the Back to the Future video game. Based on how cool he told me the game was, we decided that was our game. We grabbed it and headed back to his house, talking the whole way home about how awesome it was going to be. Once we turned it on, we were bombarded with grating music, hideous gameplay that didn't involve so much as a whiff of a flying car, and girls with hula hoops throwing balls at our heads. It was easily the worst video game we had ever played. We marched it right back to the video store and demanded a refund, but they said no. So we were stuck in the heat, with no new games to play, and nothing but our seething hatred for Back to the Future to entertain us. I despise that game to this day. Marty bears no resemblance to the film's main character. Sure, this was NES and developers could only do so much, but when the character's red life vest and brown hair are replaced with a sleeveless black shirt and black hair, you get the impression they didn't even try. Marty's standard jump is completely useless. If you try to jump over an enemy or obstacle, you just smack right into it, leaving you wondering why jump was even included. Perhaps the worst bit of all is the music, which is just an obnoxious sporadic loop of noise that repeats throughout the majority of the game. Memories of this LJN classic? Drop them in the comments. Thanks for watching.